Hey guys, welcome back to new video. And in this video, we're gonna see how we can create bottom bar in our Compose multi-platform application. First thing first, you need to create a project. So go to Kotlin Wizard website and click a new project for you. And after that, you can open that project in your Android Studio. So this is my project. And in this project, I'm gonna add dependency in our Lips version, Tomal version catalog. So this is my dependency for navigation. I'm simply add this thing. And also in my build.gradle.com, KTS of my compose I have module we need to add this dependency singer project and after that open up your source common main kotlin app.kt so this is the entry point of our compose multi-platform application because we want to create here bottom navigation item so bottom navigation item has few information like it has icon it has its label so I'm gonna just create a sealed class just to store those information I'm calling I'm calling this item we have icon and type of this thing is tribal resource next we have label type is string and lastly we have route again type is string in this I'm gonna create a data object so first is our home use items and in place of icon you'll use res this res will be generated by your compose multi-platform when you rebuild your project so res I'm interested in the drawable and in drawable we have IC home. So for this particular project, I have already added few drawables. So open your compose resource drawable. Here you can see we have IC home, add library and search. So we'll use these ones. So first we have IC home, next we have label. So label is home and lastly we have to pass the route. So route is slash home. Now simply duplicate it, we have search. So for search, we'll use IC search, label is search and route is also search. Next we have library, change the route and also change its name or you can say label and also its icon. So IC home to library and also change this data object name from home to library. Lastly, we have create and in create, we shall use IC create or I'm using IC add name import it. Route I'm using add and in place of label, I'm using create. Okay, so this is my items. Next, I'm going to create items list of it simply contains my home, my search library and create import home and search okay so now it's time to design our ui so for that i'm gonna use your scaffold and in this scaffold we have modifier fill max size in this scaffold we have bottom bar slot and in this bottom bar we'll use bottom bar and in this bottom app bar if you check its parameter we have a lot of parameters so just go in this and press ctrl p in your keyboard so as you can see, we have a lot of things. We have modifier, background color, etc. So I'm using modifier, fill max width, and its height is 55 dp. Deep. Make sure to import dp. And after that, in this trailing lambda, I'm iterating in my items. Item for each, we receive item in this. And now you can create bottom navigation item. In bottom navigation item, we have a lot of things. So first selected. So I'm going to use your selected for the time being true. Next, we need to pass on click, which we will handle later. Next, we have modifier. So in this modifier, I'm going to use height of 55 TP. And next, if you check, we'll have here label. And in this label, I'm using my text item dot label. Also, we need to pass our icon. So use your icon. Make sure to use icon that has painter. So use painter, painter resource. You can use item dot icon in here and my content description is null. Okay, so this is my bottom navigation item. Now it's time to handle its click event. So for that, I'm gonna use nav host controller. So just create, remember, nav host controller so this will give me a nav controller that will use to perform navigation now within our tree lambda of our scaffold i'm going to create a nav host and in this nav host i will pass my nav host controller and my start destination is home 
so make sure home dot route now simply just add all of my composables corresponding to their route so first we have home route we haven't created screen yet so we will create it later just duplicate this thing we have search next we have library and lastly we have create remove this last composable okay so now it's time to create our home search library and create a screen so for that at the bottom let me make some space for you and over here i'm going to create a composable first is home we will pass modifier and in this content i'm using box modifier fill max size and its content alignment is on the center and we have a very basic text in it that says home okay this is for the home i'm going to simply duplicate this thing next we'll create the same thing for search and instead of calling this thing home use search next we have library copy this paste in here uh, lastly we have create so copy this create and paste in here now use this composable in this so first we have home and make sure to pass modifier fill max size similarly we'll pass search use modifier fill max size next we have library just pass modifier fill max size and lastly we have create just use modifier fill max size so this is my four screen home lab search library and create okay so now what will happen when user click on our bottom navigation item so we will use nav host controller and perform navigation and in this navigate function we have to pass the route so in place of route i'm using item routes now in this training lambda we'll use nav host controller graph dot starting destination route and if it is not null i'm using your pop up to and pass the route after that i want to use your launch single top true and also i want to restore my state okay so when user click on it this event will occur and it will perform navigation so we are pretty much done with our bottom navigation item and also we have completed our bottom app bar so now i am going to execute this application to see whether it is working or not so let me execute this thing first on my pixel 9 api level 33 in android device okay so this is executing but my icon size is very big so let me fix it and also i want to change its background color so for that just go to your bottom app bar and over here after this height i am using background and my color is white make sure this color is coming from android x compose ui graphics scroll down here in the icon i will introduce modifier and my size is 24 dp all right so now i'm going to re-execute it okay so this time my icon size is uh, looking good but uh, the background color is won't change so we will change this later but for time being let's check whether the navigation is working or not so i'm in the home let's go search here you can see this is my search screen this is my library this is my create and when you click back you will navigate to the home and after that your application will close so this is a behavior now i need to just change the background color of my bottom bar so instead of using modifier we have one more parameter over here background color so you can simply use this thing too all right so now i want to change the selected bottom navigation item color so for that first i'm using back stack entry and this will be provided by my nav host controller dot current back stack entry in a form of state after that i'm using here current route information with the help of back stack entry dot value in this we have destination and this destination will provide me the current route this is a nullable so make sure to use your question mark okay scroll down and in this selected i'm using item dot route if it is equivalent to current route that means yes this is a selected item just use here double equals to scroll down also i want to change my label color 
so i'm using here color property if my item dot route is equivalent to current route i'm using here color red else i'm using color light gray or instead of using light gray let's use black okay i am doing the same thing for my icon so over here icon just paste it we do not have color in this we have tint re-execute our application okay so app is executing as you can see home is uh, in the form of red color when you click on the search search will become red color similarly library and create and functionality wise everything works as it was working before okay so we saw this thing in my android device now it's time to execute the same thing in my desktop so just open up your desktop main main.kt and execute it okay so there we go here you can see search library and create okay so here you can see this is my ios application search library create so everything is working fine all right so that's it for this video i hope you got a concept how to create bottom navigation bar in compose multi-platform application that is not only executable in android but it is also executable on your ios devices and desktops too we will meet in our next video where we will discuss something new about cmp till that goodbye